Barcelona registered a 3-0 win at home against Levante, after suffering a 2-1 loss at Estadi Cita to Valencia in the first leg. It ensured progression through to the quarter-finals of the Copa del Rey with a 4-2 victory on aggregate, but amid a lot of controversy and conflict regarding the first leg. The club started off by applying a lot of pressure on Levante, who were largely quiet for the entirety of the match. Philippe Coutinho led the attack from the get-go, with support from Lionel Messi in the centre-forward position and Ousmane Dembele from the right flank. The Granotas held on for some time, but gave away at the half-hour mark, as Dembele scored two quick-fire goals to give Barca the lead on aggregate. The first goal was assisted by Messi, who put the 21-year-old France international through on goal. More from everything Barca but Levante centre-back Eric Cabaco came in with a late challenge. Unfortunately for him, the tackle was scruffy and went past Ider Fernandez off Dembele's right boot. The side's second goal was also assisted by Messi, who provided yet another defence-splitting pass. This time, Dembele took it past the goalkeeper before lobbing it in. It received a little deflection off the scrambling Fernandez, but that was not enough to keep it out. The best goal of the night was scored by Messi, who netted in the 54th minute to put the game beyond any doubt. After receiving a pass from Nelson Semedo, the Argentine maestro took a very heavy touch to get past a Levante defender before flicking it past an on-rushing Ider Fernandez to score his first goal of the Copa del Rey this season. Dembele had an opportunity to score his first hat-trick for Barcelona, but his shot blazed wide of the far post after he was released by Lionel Messi yet again. Levante never had a grasp on the match, and managed to get just one shot on target the entire game. Next, Antonio Sanabria and Michi Batshkavi added to the shortlist Barca, on the other hand, managed to get 13 shots on target, with 70% possession. But it remains to be seen whether the team's progression to the next round gets halted by Levante, who are alleging that Chumi was ineligible to play in the first leg in Valencia.